The Australian snake terrier, also called the silky terrier, is very similar to the Yorkie. Its distinctive feature is its beautiful flowing coat. However, this is not just a decorative breed. At home, in Australia, these animals were used for protection and hunting. Modern snare terriers have retained all working qualities, but their friendly and loyal nature has made them excellent companions. Brief history of origin. In the years 1820-1830, a wire-haired female terrier from Tasmania, state in Australia, was brought to England. She was mated with a dandy Dinmont terrier. The puppies from this litter were purchased by MacArthur Little from London. He took up breeding work, the purpose of which was to obtain dogs with a soft silky coat. Then Little moved to Sydney, Australia, where he continued to breed dogs with Australian and Yorkshire Terriers. The result is a new variety. At the beginning of the 20th century, the first breed standard was developed. Recognition by the National Sinological Council of Australia came in 1958, the English Kennel Club and the IFF in 1965. Interesting Facts the Australian Snare Terrier is not the most popular breed. However, several interesting facts are connected with it. Initially, the breed was called Sydney Silky. The modern name of the dog was received in 1955. Silky, Yorkshire and Australian Terrier were considered a single breed until 1929. In Evgeny Abazov's film Understudy starred a snare girl named Seema. She also appeared in the TV series Wake Up Together in the company of two other Australian Terrier snares. Description of the breed, standards and appearance The Australian Silky Terrier is a small, rather stocky, but not overly stretched dog. These animals are moderately graceful, but their physique does not prevent them from hunting and exterminating rodents. The Silky Terrier is slightly larger than its Yorkie ancestor. The ideal height is 23 to 26 cm for boys, girls may be slightly smaller. Weight is not strictly regulated, but it should be appropriate for the size of the dog. The optimal performance is 3.5 to 4.5 kg. The Australian Snare Terrier moves freely and in a straight line, pushing well with its hind legs. Long hair should not interfere. Coat color and type. The long and silky coat is one of the most attractive features of the Australian breed. The hair is parted and falls beautifully on the sides of the body. There is a small gap between the bottom edge of the fur and the ground. There are no long hairs on the legs. Important. Curly, coarser short coat is not allowed. The allowed colors are any shades of blue with a rusty brown tan. The most saturated color is encouraged. Silver or white tones are excluded. There should be no dark areas on the tan. It is located on the face, cheekbones, legs, under the tail, at the base of the ears. The blue color runs from the back of the head to the tip of the tail. The admixture of red hair is unacceptable. It is interesting. Snake terrier puppies are usually born black and tan with a light blue coating. Dogs acquire the correct color by 1.5 years. Character and Behavior Representatives of the breed have the character and temperament of typical terriers. They are mobile, courageous and courageous. In case of danger, the dog is ready to protect the owner. Their dedication and perky disposition make them great companions. Australian snare terriers are cheerful and upbeat, but always retain their dignity. They are friendly and affectionate, loneliness is hard to endure. However, these dogs can entertain themselves by exploring the territory or hunting birds. The snare terriers have a developed hunting instinct, so they cannot be kept together with rodents and other small pets. On a walk, an Australian breed may fight another dog to show that he is a leader. Silky terriers get along well with children, but not all dogs tolerate loud screams and intrusive attention. Therefore, adults should tell the kids in advance about the rules of behavior with pets and control their joint games. How to choose the right puppy. Babies are weaned from their mother not earlier than two months. At this age, they are active and curious. In healthy puppies, shiny fur coat, moderately well-fed body, clean eyes and ears, cool and wet nose. On examination, no deviations from the standard should be visible. To be sure of the breed of puppies, you should get acquainted with their parents. The animals must be free from defects in appearance or temperament. Puppy care. The first month of life, the mother takes care of the puppies. Then the kids are introduced to solid food and taught to eat from a bowl on their own. After moving to a new house, the Australian snake terrier equips a cozy couch in a quiet corner and buys utensils for food and water, harness and leash for walking, toys of different shapes and sizes, tray. At two months, the puppy is fed five times a day in small portions. They give him porridge, meat, dairy products, vegetables. From three months, sea fish is introduced into the diet, from four months, offal. The number of feedings is reduced to four and the portions are slightly increased. In agreement with a veterinarian, the snares buy the terrier vitamin and mineral supplements. At six months, the puppy can eat three times a day. 
His diet is as close as possible to an adult, but food is given a little more as the dog continues to grow. In the year of the Australian Terrier Snare, they are transferred to two meals a day. In the morning, it is better for the pet to eat light food, and in the evening, high-calorie cereals and meat. Care and Maintenance of an Adult Dog Australian Silky Terriers adapt easily to any living environment. Representatives of the breed do well in small apartments. But they love to spend time outside, so the dog will like a private house with its own plot more. The site should be well fenced, as Silky Terriers jump well and like to dig tunnels. Correct diet. To feed the terrier snare, you can use both ready-made feed and natural food. In the first case, you should choose products of at least premium class. It most fully meets the needs of the canine body. Important. Mixing both types of food is prohibited, this will lead to digestive problems. When feeding natural, the basis of the diet is lean meat. One to two times a week it is replaced with offal. Sea fish and chicken eggs are introduced with the same frequency. Other components of the daily menu, oat, rice, buckwheat porridge, fermented milk products, kefir, cottage cheese, yogurt, natural yogurt, vegetables, carrots, pumpkin, zucchini, cauliflower, broccoli. Fruit pieces, bananas, apples, pears, can be used as treats. To maintain the health of the wool, add a tablespoon of vegetable oil to the porridge. With natural nutrition, pets are periodically given vitamin and mineral supplements. Important. Food from the human table is contraindicated in silky terriers. Walking and physical activity. The Australian Snare Terrier loves long walks and will never refuse to run free. It is advisable to take your pet to parks where he can frolic to his heart's content. The optimal duration of exercise is one hour. Note. The Snare of Terriers has no undercoat, so in winter it is better to dress dogs in insulated overalls. Training and Education. Australian Snare Terriers are smart, but their innate willfulness makes training difficult. To achieve obedience, the owner will have to be patient. From early childhood, the puppy is socialized, otherwise he may grow up shy and timid. The kid is introduced to the world around him, taught to remain calm in the presence of a large number of people and other animals. From about four months old, terrier snares begin to be trained in a playful way. Dogs quickly get bored with monotonous activities, so the lessons are made as interesting as possible. It is recommended to take your pet for a walk. He will throw out excess energy and be more focused. Care and Hygiene The Australian Silky Terrier needs to be bathed every 10 days with a long-haired shampoo to keep it looking its best. Most of the breed loves water, so the procedure will not cause problems. The luxurious fur coat is brushed daily with a massage brush. If the wool is matted, it is carefully untangled by hand. Scissors are used only as a last resort. Other hygiene procedures. Washing paws and rubbing wool after walking. Cleaning eyes and ears, once a week. Claw trimming, once a month, if the pet walks only on soft surfaces. Worming, once every three months. In the warm season, terrier snares are regularly treated for fleas and ticks. Vaccinations and disease propensity Australian terrier snares are vaccinated according to the standard schedule. 8 to 9 weeks, complex vaccine. 11 to 12 weeks, revaccination. 6 to 7 months, after the end of the change of teeth, rabies vaccination. In the future, the puppy is vaccinated at 12 months, after which they are vaccinated every year. Silky terriers are a fairly healthy breed. However, dogs are prone to certain diseases, colds, dysplasia of the hip and elbow joints, dislocation of the patella, epilepsy, cataracts and progressive retinal atrophy, diabetes mellitus. Competent care and regular visits to the veterinarian minimize the risk of pathologies. On average, Australian snake terriers live 12 to 15 years. Pros and cons of the breed. Pros. Spectacular appearance. Compact dimensions. It adapts well to any conditions. Devotion, friendliness, poise. Sharp mind. Courage and courage. Minuses. High activity. Stubbornness. Conflicts with relatives are possible. Developed hunting instinct. The Australian Silky Terrier is a cute compact breed that has both decorative and working qualities. Such a pet will bring joy and surprise every day with funny tricks. The cost to adopt a Silky Terrier is around $300 US in order to cover the expenses of caring for the dog before adoption. In contrast, buying Silky Terriers from breeders can be prohibitively expensive. Depending on their breeding, they usually cost anywhere from $800 US dollars $3,500 US dollars.